Yo guys, how's it going and welcome back to a Rainbow Six Siege video. Now today guys, I'm going to be back on the map Skyscraper, showing you how to get under the map like I did as a defender. But this time you do not have to leave the building, which is insane. Now the founder of this glitch is DB Online, so I'll leave his link in the description down below. And it is a really good channel, so just make sure to go check it out. But guys, for this glitch, all you need is a shield, and that's pretty much it. You can be any operator with a shield, as long as it's easy, and I prefer obviously small characters that are faster. But guys, all you have to do is follow my steps to be able to do it, so let's get into the video. So guys, what you want to do is come to this bamboo plant over here, and then what you want to do is hit at the exact same spots that I hit out. So guys, you first want to hit the front bit, then go towards like the back bit over there, hit these two bits at the back, obviously, you know, so you can just get through, and hit this bit at the front. See, this bit here, just make sure you get through, obviously you got that stick there, and what you want to do is just try and wedge your weight in, so you actually can get there while the bamboo's there at the same time. Now guys, what I've done is I've put DBO lines clip in a bit better just to show you what's going on and you'll be able to see what's happening from there. Now guys, as you saw, you go straight onto the map but all of those, oh, your like, top half is showing now. So what you have to do is kind of like duck down and move around so you can actually get under and you can see most of the spawn peaks, which is really good. Now the upside of this glitch is that it's fun to use, obviously against your teammates, you can muck around, but the downside is you can use this on ranked and casual, which is a bit of an unfair advantage against the enemy team. Now guys, please do go report this glitch because it is really OP and people are wondering why am I posting this because people don't want to see glitches what I'm posting him just so it gets the Ubisoft like, attention to actually report it and obviously patch the glitch because otherwise if I go and report it as like a normal person that doesn't have any views or anything like that Ubisoft might ignore me and not see the glitch at all whereas they see obviously you've got thousands of views and be able to see, like, patch them a lot easier because they know what's going on and I'm always being like a help to obviously Rainbow Six Siege to make sure everything's better but guys, from the clip you can see a bunch of stuff, what is happening, obviously what the glitch is like at the same time. So do make sure to report this glitch because you can see how OP it is. Now guys, that's going to be the end of the video. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe button if you're on our end And hit that notification bell for more daily Rainbow Sixes glitches. And also guys, before I end the video, I'm going to be doing some more gameplay and sort of like talking about the game and what should be better. Because I think that's a bit better and I'm getting a bit bored of glitches in my opinion. If you think so and you like that, make sure to actually tell me in the description what you want to see next. Until next time. See ya.